campus, of course, changed forever here at Michigan State as the students are trying to resume their lives after last week's deadly shooting. The university trying to give these students a lot of space, a lot of leeway, and a lot of support. They want to make sure that if they need help, they can find it, and they're offering that help in a number of different ways on campus here at Michigan State. Sue, so we'll send it back to you. We've got a lot more coming up tonight at 6 and 7. Until then, Brian Sterling reporting live from East Lansing. Yeah, just such a huge outpouring of support to those students on what had to be an incredibly difficult day. Brian, thank you. Spartans not only returned to class in East Lansing, but also in Grand Rapids today. New Saints Megan Bunchman spoke with students at MSU's medical campus, and she joins us right now from the newsroom. Megan? Sue, so students I talked with today say that although they weren't on the East Lansing campus last week when shots rang out, they still are deeply impacted and affected by this mass shooting. Fear, grief, um, numb, um, Hopeful, mm -hmm. um, overwhelmed, yeah. tired, angry. All natural. Yeah, All natural. a lot of emotions. Even before classes and clinics resume today at MSU's medical campus in Grand Rapids, Larissa Dean's first year medical class was given the space to process and grieve openly and among their peers this morning. We talked with um, each other. We did like a little reflection thing for an hour. Mm -hmm and talked about how we felt, what emotions were going through our head, and that kind of helped us process it a little bit better. It was a difficult week for every Spartan across the country, even if they weren't on the East Lansing campus last Monday. We are in Grand Rapids here, but we have another medical campus in East Lansing, and half of our class is there, so our peers experienced this much more deeply than we did, but um, you know, all of us know people there and it's it's been difficult for all of us. While it will take time for every student to process and grieve a school shooting so close to home. Just a little bit of anxiety, a little bit of, I don't know, we have like a little um, memorial. memorial out, so um, it's kind of tough coming back first day, but um, I thought the school did a good job. We took like the first hour, we just had breakfast. The shift towards mental health experts and services on college campuses and morning group talk sessions like today's will slowly help students get back to a new normal within these walls. And we're not going to get to 100% right away, but just knowing other support from the faculty and from administration helps a lot. MSU continues to offer counseling services and crisis resources for all of its employees, students, and staff. For a full list of help for you, MSU Spartans, head on over to our website, woodtv.com. Sue.